our run of dry days is going to continue all the way through the weekend. And we're going to stay above average, seven to eight degrees above average, and hints of even warmer air by the middle and end of next week. Listen to Mike Burrish's daily weather podcast. You can get that on demand in the WOKV. Apple stay dry, mostly sunny. Temps into the 70s, maybe waking up to some fog or gray clouds uh, on Saturday and Sunday with a little bit more humidity in the air. But all in all, an ideal weekend for all the Christmas events that we have in Avondale, Green Cove Springs, and one of the signature ones, the big parade in St. Augustine. We're running through all of the weekend events in detail at WOKV.com and in our app as well. Sending you the breaking news alert as the Senate uh, ended up passing that short-term spending plan that uh, keeps uh, the government funded through at least mid to late February. So no government shutdown uh, amid uh, some concerns about vaccine mandates and more. We'll continue to follow the effort to uh, try to extend the debt limit. That's the next big shut shutdown showdown fight, if you will, uh, in the Congress. A story we'll follow for you in depth throughout the day. And continuing coverage of what happened in a Jacksonville community where a man is now facing multiple charges for kidnapping a woman and torturing her. She later died. He's not yet charged with her death. It's an ongoing storyline that we'll follow for you in depth at WOKV.com and in the 104.5 WOKV app. Have a safe weekend. We'll see you at the Brian Kilmeade event tonight in Ponte Vedra and continuing coverage of all these stories in the WOKV app.